But we start tonight's action with something slightly different. A pillow fight. This comes from the Pillow Fighting Championships. And it starts off with Bulgaria facing Bulgaria. Bushiro 88, Stuymenov vs. Soroka with a little appetizer. First time on Bulgarian soil, we have a pillow fighting championship. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. Hard action from the beginning. We have Dimitrova, which is keeping her chin tucked, trying to land. Good blocking. Ooh. It's interesting, Peter. You know, when they came in, they were smiling. Yeah. And it didn't look like they were perhaps taking it as seriously as a real fight, but now the fight has started. They're not smiling anymore. <laughs> <laughs> They're focused. Hey, a fight is a fight, even with a pillow, right? Well, yeah. I mean, this is probably new to most people here, but there is some skill involved. Both these girls have been training, and I was watching them warming up. There is uh, an interesting variety of techniques. And just to let the audience know how uh, this is scored, uh, obviously we've got a referee in there, but there's a spinning back pillow strike there, which scores three points. Um, a strike just straight to the head scores a point. And if you uh, hit someone in the leg then, uh, or the body, there's no points. But if you hit someone anywhere and it knocks them down, that also scores a point. So, the judges are accruing points as the round goes on. Oh, the ladies are getting tired. Yes. Okay. 
midway through the first round. Action packed, action packed. Yeah, this uh, it's an interesting one because it's a funny, you know, um, fitness is um, specific to an activity. You know, striking has got a certain kind of fitness and uh, grappling is another kind of fitness. This pillow uh -huh. fighting, it's going to take it out of you swinging that thing around. Absolutely, absolutely. They're not switching hands, they're using predominantly the right hand, blocking with the left one. We, we saw a smile coming on Gilgiev's face. Ooh, let's see, let's see, 10 seconds. Oh, yes. nice, nice attempt at a spinning back pillow there. <laughs> That's not what you call that. Spinning but, uh, back pillow sounds very nice. Yeah. So an interesting uh, end to the first round. You see there in the red corner, Georgieva shaking her arms out. So she's feeling that pace. It's two two-minute rounds. Yeah, I think both are feeling the pace because also Dimitrova's right hand is pretty, is pretty tired. Let's hope they switch. Let's hope they can keep it up for another 90 seconds. Excuse me, two minutes. It's okay, Matt's moved. Maths was never my strong point on it. <laughs> oh, you're on the replay. A very nice backhand action coming out from Dimitrova. Great blocking. Great I mean, blocking. I don't want to say anything inappropriate, but uh, there's other reasons to watch this contest apart from the striking. Um, Absolutely. But let's not go there. So here we go. That is a the second round. Second round, decisive round. Let's see. Watch what the smiles out. disappear as soon as the first strike lands. Absolutely. There we go. Oh, a nice backspin. Nice backspin. The corner is yelling not to have that much of a spin, but that spin has paid off for Dimitrova, and she landed a point. Good it's circling around. Oh. It's interesting that. Um, the pillow fighting, PFC, it's got a huge following in America. There's been um, Marines and soldiers and all sorts of people fighting. And uh, you wouldn't consider them, I don't know how well they get on it in um, pure fighting, kickboxing, MMA or grappling or whatever, but uh, perhaps we're going to see emerging as this sport grows specialists. I hope so. In pillow fighting. I, I much rather uh, prefer to see pillow fighting rather than the slap fighting competitions that are coming yes. out right now. Yes. I think this is much more entertaining. And there is an element of show involved, if, if we might add. Yeah, I think one thing people have got to remember about uh, combat sports, an event like this is a night of entertainment, so it's combat sports entertainment. People are here for a night out and to enjoy themselves. And Dimitrova and Georgieva are entertaining indeed. Yeah. Yep, the action hasn't slowed down. They're both tired. Absolutely. That was a nice strike. Ooh, nice strike, nice strike. Good one. Took her ability of time to recuperate. They see they're getting tired right now. Those right hands are tired. Would, they're getting I tired know. and they're having to plan their shots now. I don't know, but I would like to see them uh, switch grips, you know, maybe. Oh, the pillow is down. Very good sportsmanship. Yeah, other, other contests I've seen, the guys are using both hands to swing the pillow. Absolutely. But both these girls are using a tactic where they're blocking with that lead hand. Seconds. Okay, okay, some action in the last 10 seconds. And who will be the winner? You can see the effort they're putting oh. in to hurt their opponent with those pillows. And they, they, they mean, they mean to hit with that bag. Ooh. The end of the round there. Absolutely, and I think this is the end of... So that's the fight. end of the fight. Two, two minute so. rounds. Two minute rounds. Two, two Let's minute go rounds. to the judges. Okay, now. And I hope the audience gives a round of applause for both pillow fighters. Okay. Pillow fighting championships making a de debut in Bulgaria. And uh, we hope to see some more. You just need time to deliberate. I guess it's difficult. They both threw some nice shots. Yeah, give a round of applause. Presenting our women's bracket for this contest will be our promoter, Luan Edmonton. And after two rounds of action, 
We go to the judges' scorecards, and we have a unanimous decision in favor of your winner. From the red corner, Suzanne Jokeva! The winner of this bout, the field fighting championship bout, is Susan Jokeva. Well, I guess her headshots were more than uh, Dimitrova's headshots. Hey, they're all smiles. It's all fun and games. Until somebody gets hit with the pillowcase. Round of applause. And now we're heading into our next bout, which is a K1 bout, uh, a K1 rules bout with MMA gloves. Three rounds, three minutes between Pantelis Zulumis and Ilian Adrianov. Pantelis Zulumis is a representative of, Greek, of Greece, and Ilian Adrianov is a Bulgarian homeboy. We're seeing some highlights. Dimitrova had some success with her backspin, but the counters of Georgieva said their word. No, I don't know, but I'm sure if the hit is clean and flush, 